It's warm outside. I'm just gonna sit down in front here. Look at this. So it's pretty warm inside right now. We're boiling some water. Uh, yeah, working on, on some projects here. And uh, some wood to hold this door. Uh, it's a nice bell tent and it's gonna rain tonight. We're gonna test it out. It's gonna be stormy too, so let's have fun and let's see. Okay, these must be ready. Yeah, really hot. Mmm, yeah. Ready. This is mine. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, I'm sitting here in my command station in the canvas tent. There's lots of rain. Pretty, pretty much a stormy night. Yeah, that's that's the mosquito net in front, but the whole tent, the whole tent. There's nothing dripping. Thank God. Look at this. Pretty good. Only this spot right here is dripping. Not on my friend. That's good. Now it's getting too warm. So just damper that. Close the air intake a bit. That's it. Chaga's warming up. Little sip of chaga. Bedtime. Uh, last time I made a kuska. Didn't finalize it because it broke here. Can still do something with the bottom, but now I just decided to keep it keep it around camp just for a little table. Put my uh, camp towel on the floor here to be comfortable to wipe my feet when I get into my bed. Uh, Medikit, all my um, that's my camp soap, my uh, powder for my feet. That's itching lotion, citro bug. Nascent Iodine X2 Survival Shield, very good for lots of things. Three drops of this every day. Shaver with the sharpening block, right here. Sh 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 sharpening that, to sharpen that. All I'm missing here is a mirror. Kaboom! And I have a filter in the bottom, so it's a nice kit here. Very rainy. Yes, very rainy outside. Very, very, very rainy. What's going, guys? I'm just putting up everything. I'm just, um, putting out everything in the stove. I call it my toolbox and you'll see why. So first of all, I'm gonna put that part here. That's the damper part. Ah, let's take it out. It's just, there's a little spring I don't wanna lose. So I'll just put it back. It's still warm. This is still warm. <laughs> Get it, let it cool off. So all the chimney is in here. Once it really cools off, once it's really cooled off, I'll be able to put the tools in it. A bit warm, nothing dangerous. So I'm gonna go get the toolbox. So, as you'll see later on, this is going to be on the fat top of my pack. We're gonna close that door if we need something. We just have to open the door and use the tools that are inside.
that's my auger. All right. And we'll put these candles in later on because it's still a bit warm. We're gonna take this tent up, uh, off and uh, off we go. If you wanna see how it works really fast, it's nothing complicated. We actually set it um, permanent tent pegs here. So we're gonna leave the tent pegs there. So the only rope I have to take off is this one here. All the rest will come off really easier. This one I'll roll for now. Nice bundle. Last night we had a big thunderstorm and uh, no problem, the stunt was amazing. All right. There you go. So, I have the pole for next time. See how waterproof it is? It's like a parachute. And I sprayed it yesterday too, so it's for sure. Okay, now all I have to do, take these off nicely. There's two sets of pegs. Yeah, I'll leave this one here. No, make a fold. I'll make it look good. Fold it nice. Remind you, this is my permanent setup, so all these tent pegs are gonna stay here. Makes our life way easier. Now what I wanna do is simply pull on the middle Bring one side under. There you go, like that. They all fit together now. You don't need to do much. That's the center, where's the center? Most of it is done. Well, fold it one more time. It has to fit into my pack. Use that end to pull on it. Very small. Mind you, there's, they're mildew treated, so it won't really smell bad. It'll just uh, accumulate some, some... All right. So that's the first part, then two little parts we're gonna see. I got my floor mat, Nalgene, extra collapsible bottle, a, a, a shovel, a solar panel kit. Here I have tarp and billy can. Over here I have sleeping bag and some water bags that are empty. Ready to go. 
And now, pull that off. See, it's gonna fit nicely in there. Any size you want, any type, any side you want. Maybe like that. Toma bed net. It's nicely here. I'm gonna put my camel back. There we go. Everything is inside the pack. And then the last step is to latch the wood stove on top here. Last step. We're lucky it's not raining. We're gonna put it on top here. So I'm just gonna lean his bag, my bag on next to his. Beautiful brother, brother. Okay, let's get those straps. Boom, boom. One, two, there you go. That's good. Okay. Get these straps, you can see them. Good. Wedge them. Now, that has cool off, so we can put the candles. Anything else you have, you put it in there. Do a little quick checkup. Nothing else? And you'll see the magic after. You'll see what I mean. So I close this. Make sure it's secured and tight. Maybe the heat just... Okay, it's the spring. Anyways. Alright. Put that on top. Take the compression straps, put it over. The Molly 2 has an excellent uh, um, top, has an excellent lashing uh, um, system. So, as you see here, I can latch the wood stove perfectly. Now remind you, if it'd be raining, we'd have to put something on top. But now, it's not raining. Now just have to center it. Centered. Compress it nicely. See? Now the strap is too... Let's see again. With the gloves, it's really not good. Ugh. Repair that quick. I pack my bags like that. I don't know about you. Sometimes I, I stuff things, but I always like to have a nice prepared folded pack so I can fit more inside. I take care of the details beforehand. Right here, I need more slack. It's gonna hold like a charm. It's what, 20 pounds? Like a packer with all the accessories, maybe 25 pounds. There you go. That's packed. The low end buckle here. Buckle it. Make sure everything is nicely strapped. Okay, here's the advantage now. When you need something, you can just open the gate here and get what you want.